Liver snacks. Liver snacks. That's it. Pulse your own. You oh, figure it out? Who's playing? You lost the three. There's a three on Kill shots. All right. Five, buck, five, five, five. We didn't ten. go five. We won quarter. Uh, To my dad. To the Gramps. Absolutely. To the Gramps. His place, his everything. Yeah, the Gramps. Gene Gort. The Gramps, the Gene. Love, love. love you, Pops. The Gramps. Gene. Over the years here at Simon Brothers Outdoors, we have been blessed with some unbelievable deer camps. Some would even say that deer camps are the content that we are most known for. And every year, nothing compares to our trips to Camp Gore in West Virginia. Fits. Have him turn around. I think it fits. <laughs> it's a medium. I think it's fine. Have to turn around. Get the back. You, you can buy medium shirts. I don't think it. You should start. Unfortunately, this year was going to be a little bit different, as it was our first year in camp without Grandpa, and we wanted to make sure we did it right just for him. All right, guys. It is Thursday, November 17th and we are leaving for deer camp officially. Uh, me and Isaac are taking one truck. Chris and his dad are taking another truck. Matt was supposed to be here with us, but he's got the COVID again for like was the third time. So he might come down later in the week once he starts feeling better. But we're leaving evening time now, so we're not gonna be able to take a lot of video driving down. We gotta stop at the store and stuff, and we probably won't even get in the cabin until after 11 o'clock, because it's almost six now. So it's gonna be a little bit, but uh, it's deer camp week. We look forward to this forever. Yeah. Let's do this thing. If this road's bad, the next road's gonna be really bad. Pretty good for four hours. Yeah, I slept pretty good for three. Yeah, what were you doing last night? You left some cabin. <laughs> yeah, I'm not arguing about the cabin. Oh, those aren't mine. Those are. Those are. Who are the other guys? Someone else's. Hey, Chris, I got your coffee mug for you. <laughs> That's Matt's mug. <laughs> <laughs> Make fun of guys not even here. <laughs> <laughs> not playing. Not on the truck. Why do we? Why do we do it, Chris? Some might say we're crazy. We are crazy. Not gonna get them in the cabin, though, eh? That's 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 a fact. in the minis. Yep. Carrying up the mountain with all my camera stuff. It's going to be fun. Hanging it in the dark. Yeah, it's not going to be dark. But <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it'll be dark anymore by the time we get up there. Well, good luck, brother. Brother. I think we're leaving. You guys are leaving? Yeah. I'm leaving too. Good luck. We're going. I guess I could do my opening interview now. It's been real cold, so it's been kind of been trying to conserve some heat, but 
Hopefully that buck works his way over to Chris. I would have shot it for sure. Here in West Virginia with the bow, definitely would have shot that buck. But the closest he got was about 55. That road down there is 55. So, no opportunity. I did give him some grunts to see if I could get him to pull back, come investigate, but he wasn't interested. He stayed out of range as well. He walked that same path, 55 yards. Well, as you can tell how bundled up I am. It's cold, I'm calling it. It's about 10.30, 10.45. Pretty good morning though. All right. I'm being a little girl. I'm done with this wind. Uh, I'm gonna grab some trail cameras and make my way back towards Chris. Uh, see if he wants to stay up any longer, if he wants to go back down to the cabin, but it's time to go get some breakfast and take a nap and just enjoy deer camp life in the cabin. That whole front side that nobody really hunts, I can kind of see down there.
Well, it's now the afternoon. The scenery is a little bit different than it was this morning. While we were eating lunch and taking a little midday siesta, it snowed a lot. Unfortunately, as sometimes happens with technology, I lost the audio from my GoPro that evening. And like Isaac mentioned earlier, we got a fresh blanket of snowfall up on the mountain. Well, I know it doesn't look like much, the camera, but this hill with fresh snow on the ground, it's going to be slippery and sucky. The camera's flattened out, but it's pretty steep and pretty high. Well, I certainly hope the deer guides are on our, uh, on our side tonight. Things did not go according to plan on my side of the mountain that evening.
Audio's working this time. Crank. Crank. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Spencer every morning just has to deal with our kitchen shenanigans and see the couch sleeper. Apparently he was sleeping yesterday. He's got the warmest <laughs> he's got the warmest spot on in the cabin though. I was freezing in there. Yeah, I closed the, the door. The I wasn't that I wasn't cold. Stop closing the door. <laughs> Don't fall down the stairs. <laughs> It'll be a great start to the day. Oh shit. <clears throat> It's not a good stand. No, I mean the stand is beautiful. I did not like you sharing it. Together. I did not like did sharing it with Chris. You're sitting up there, you look to the left. Well, you already moved in. I leave for a couple hours. A little shrub. Yeah. 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 Right there was standing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like 15 yards. Oh. Isaac, nap time is officially yeah, over. over. The calm before the storm is over. Darren was in Ripley already. We talked. Everyone's about. rolling into camp here soon. Where's Matt at? All the extras. Yeah. Well, we ain't got no phone for me. Yeah, we need to go up. So. Went up top. Oh. Oh, then how do you know he's on his way? He's so, told last night I talked I didn't to him. Check, he said, I was checking to see if I had his phone number. I don't think Dude, I Look what I got it. <laughs> we got a whole bunch too. Christmas chocolate. Dude. Cookies. Chocolate, what? peanut butter. Funny bones. Funny bones. Uh, what are yeah. those? Twinkies. Twinkies. What? Huh? Dad got them for us. Oh, I love the Dollar General. It's about to get wild in here. <laughs> Dad bought them. Chris, I think we gotta wake up. He wouldn't let me get a watermelon. Good party. You're never allowed to get a watermelon. It's like 40 now with six kids. Alexis, Texas is not 40. <laughs> she is. We're gonna I bet look you she's at least 38. We'll have to look that up when we have service. Yeah. We, yeah, we, we, can't, we can't. What does that even? What does that mean? We, we can't fact don't check find that right now. 38 year olds or 40 year olds attractive? Homemade beef turkey. Kids. It just means she does it. <laughs> My ear. Does it no, sound you're, loud? I'll listen to it again. I thought it sounded like it was vibrating a little bit. It might be. I don't know. Dude, to make sure everything's tight. Yeah, there's a vibration. I can hear it. That's how you check. Well, what the fuck would be loose? Hmm? Oh, you need to tighten these screws right here. Yeah, right. mods loose. That's what's making noise. Yep. We got a, anybody got a torque? Anybody got a torque? Kevin, Kevin, you got torque. Kevin, you got torque heads? What? You got any torque heads? They're in that kit. Hex? <coughs> the kit that, is the there hex in there? <coughs> That's not going to change anything? No. It sounds like it. I'll grab it. It just sounds loud to me when I shoot. Yeah, it was a little high, damn it. I, but you guys yeah. were all... Isaac Isaac was in the money. Yeah. Oh, you guys were all pretty close. Isaac got the money. Yeah. Oh, man. They're all kill shots. All right. Five bucks. Five. 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 We didn't ten. go five. We're going quarter. <laughs> Back by the creek, what, probably 30? I can shoot 30. I'm not gonna be as accurate as that. Yeah. Well, your dad it? won that round. No, oh, I think I won that round. Bro, your dad put a perfect one in there. He ain't that good. He ain't that good. He ain't that good. That's what I say, we need to have a, another thing, get everybody together and uh, shoot them. Who's is this? That's dad's. That's close one. This is yours? Yeah, that's mine. Very close. Uh, you got me, Pops. That was my second arrow, though. Oh, that was your second arrow? Yeah, first arrow. Oh, then I'm the winner. First arrow caught green, too, though. Then I'm the winner. Mine's yeah, first winner. arrow. Eight one. Yeah. Nice, God. Nice fucking shot. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Oh, I thought Buddy got Oh, yeah. He was all over the fucking place I earlier. What happened, yo? Sandbag. 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 Sandb
Thanks, man. You needed it, right? We'll see. You're out of money? <laughs> I'm not out of money. I'm out of dollars. Because risk I'm not going far. Down the All right, Chris, we're ready. We're Last far. money shot. I'm your sponsor. You don't owe me shit. Don't hit the pine tree. You only owe me if you win. Oh. That's going out there 30. No. Yeah, it is. That's a good one. Well, that's going 30. You're killing us, Chris. That's a good one. That's a good one. Nice. That's a good one. that area. That's a good one. Green. Last archery money shoot. Last one, Chris. This is your last chance to win a dollar. Oh, there's some schmeg on the lens. Got it. 28? Yeah. Two the big ones. I said 27. It's a definitely 20. Are we going big one? I had a piece. I gotta get that out of there. Eat it, guys. Of the outer circle, the orange and white is, but it's, I mean, it's fucking close. That's Chris, that's Chris all day. Chris, that's you all day. I won! I got money to play games. <laughs> well, here you go, take your dollar. Thank hey, dog. I gotta pay Spencer now. I gotta pay I my good. sponsor now. I got good height. Oh, that's a tenner. I gotta pay my sponsor. I had good height, yeah, Chris but I just me. I'll, I didn't I'll pay any dollars to anybody for like four years. Very nice. Even. Very nice. Fucking pretty as shit. I mean, I brought a bunch of retro magazines that look real good sitting on that. Yeah. Heck yeah, man. We're moving up in the world. We are. We're living a high life. We are. Even though we're drinking this beer. Hey. Look at that. Perfect. That's pretty shit. Look at that fucker. God damn. All right, this floor gets a little dirty. Yeah. It's fuck. So we were running out of beer, you, uh, and then Matt showed up. And now we're really low. Yeah, we're, we're, <laughs> we are not low. Look at that stack! Ow, oh, damn it. You hit me in the arse. You hit him. Matt showed up. Matt you hit me in the arse with the door, though. Matt showed up with all the beer. Thank God. We were I so feel thirsty. I bad about all the thing, bad things I said about him. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, they're all on the video, too, so that's okay. Yeah, that's fine. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> <Not a picture>. <laughs> <laughs> Darren used to do that. Remember when he yeah, yeah, Darren yeah, he'd, yeah. he'd post like the picture? <laughs> hey, favorite son, come here. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> what? You're I'll my horse partner. I'll just say. <laughs> Oh, 
That's what you just did. <laughs> Caleb, right? We had this conversation last we year. We did have this conversation <laughs> last year. And he's videotaping us. Now. For the record, that is not what I said. It is not what I said. What? <laughs> I don't know the game though. Dice. Oh. With chips. Last year I won a um, right, trivia game. We're gonna play Whoever's tonight. left with the last one. Probably won't play tonight. Why? Right. Because you guys are scared. We have dice left, right, center. I'm playing left, right, center. We play Hurricane. I don't even know what that is. We it's, can play left, right, it's, center. It's a uh, three, really? seven. After I win at this game. It's three, seven, and double. We're gonna go side three up the table. There's a lot of people that can play left, right, center. That's a lot of money. Three, seven, and double. That's a lot of money. 2013. Come on, sir. Why is she hate us now? Jalen, that one right there. Over up the two. Push it in, Darren. I went over him and put one in. Push it in. Give me a push it out. Give him three. Listen, this is a rare time that I take shots, Jim Beam Apple. I'm ripping it. And rip, rip stick it. Rip stick it. Rip stick it. Yeah. Thirteen percent and half. You gotta hit like a man. Oh yeah. Rip ticket. <laughs> Don't mind my Cheeto fingers or my hobo gloves, but if Darren's offered shots, God, that's good. Delicious. Yeah. That's good. Darren, Darren, Darren. We can open another bottle. Right. 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 We who's playing? Oh, bitch. Eight people. That's two people. Oh, I know. I'm saying, man. Fuck it. Are you all right now? I'm fucking fine. Somebody down my three. I see it. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. Oh, the man. Uh, okay. Just, hold on to him. We need to see him. Hold him tight. Like hell. No. Negative. Put it under my tail. Fuck it. No. <laughs> Chris, we can do a toast. Come on, let's do your toast. Chris, we're gonna Chris, do a toast. Chris, Chris what do you want your toast to be? To? We'll do a toast. Come on. We'll a do a toast. toast. Right. A legit toast. toast to my dad. To the Gramps. Absolutely. To yeah. Gramps. His place. His everything. Yeah. To Gramps. Gene Gort. To Gramps. To Gene. Love, love. love you, pops. To Gramps. Gene. What's you here? Hell yeah. <laughs> Go well, to the old casino. <laughs> we decided. <laughs> well, uh, you guys thought I went fast. Yeah, we decided that we were just going to leave Deer Camp and go to the casino, so there's that. Yeah, we're going to do that tonight. <laughs> all three, all three, no, they're in, uh, all three of our wives are going to be like watching the video one day. They're going to be like, what? Yeah. You left your kid to go to where? Andrew's like, hold on, you spent a hundred bucks where? hundred bucks? <laughs> yeah, because that's where I'm cutting myself off. Because I have a problem. <laughs> yeah, a hundred dollars is a problem. <laughs> I'm not even going to tell you what I fucking I, I know that. <laughs> well, we made it back. This is the longest night of deer camp ever, by hey, the way. We're good to this go. is the longest night of deer oh, camp yeah. ever. Casino. So oh. fun. Oh, so man. fun. What an adventure. Thanks, Kevin. You're welcome. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what are these? Unyeasted cookies. <laughs> yeah, Isaac explained how these grow in a jar and you scrape some of the top off and then you. Put them in the microwave or the oven. As and far as I know. Shucks, I just got a hole in He them. said that they were alive. They got first prize They're in living the cookie cookies. contest. <laughs> living cookies. <laughs> got first place at the cookie contest, man. Good job. Bro, round two of Got to let them cool off outside, right? Let them cool off. Oh, look at that fire ripping over there. Ripping. 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 Thanksgiving, Chris. Like, not really Thanksgiving. <laughs> For Thanksgiving for Deer Camp. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Thanksgiving 2022. Mm. Yep. 2022. We got there. No, be able to do it through the ages of Chris. J.M. Edwards, right. Edwards Construction. Thank you. That's called J.M. Edwards Construction hoodie on. <laughs> they don't even exist anymore.
Probably not. Is this even my gun? Yeah. Sure looks like it. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it. Ah. Yeah, see-through scope rings too. Yeah. That's an old school rifle. It's a real rifle. This thing's awesome. Damn, too tall. I'm too big. What target you got? I'm gonna shoot the bottom below where he shot. The bottom corner? Yeah. Pretty close though. A little low, that's pretty close, pretty low. Yeah, if anything, it should be an inch high. Yeah. These are a reload. Hi. <laughs> Where'd you hit? Hi. Nothing better than gun the beer, dog. Three oh eight's good to go. Twenty five is even better. Ah, my ear. <laughs> my arms just got impregnated. You right, size my hole hole size. Your holes are bigger. Your hose are bigger. I wasn't very far off. No, my second shot was where it needed to be. Those are yours. Nothing going wrong. Three right just doesn't shoot as good. <laughs> Pretty sure that's me. That's where I was aiming. Well, I don't my right scope will see that part. I'll take that. It's like a Mine scope. shoots a little high. I'll take that. It's like a, it's a laser. Mine's directly yeah. on it. We finally got you to let us season up the turkey every year. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. The whole sections of that aren't seasoned up. I just put it in the bag. It all runs off. I tried rubbing it and the turkey is frozen so all the season as soon as you rub it. <laughs> the turkey's been thawing for four days. It's been no, no since please. last Sunday. <laughs> I bought it last Sunday, I left it out. Man. What temperature? Thirty-six. And now we start. Give us three. Three nothing? Mm, yippers. Camp dog. Uh, what did she say? It's old camp dog. She said the name when we were over there. Hercules, Heath, uh, help, something. Heath. Yeah. I hope his name's Heath. That's funny. Maybe. 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 Ten to four. Oh, it is. Yeah, I'll go check the score. How much further before I can bring in the? Oh, oh you just gotta get the taters cooked. Is anybody taking care of the taters? They just beeped. They just beeped. Don't they have to sit in there? No, they gotta be taken out and stirred and put back in for two and a half minutes. Got it. Minutes. And a lot of liquid in there, dude. Extra gravy in there. The gravy toss. Which way? I got gravy in my underwear. I'm gonna try to get it out of that bag and sit down in there. Oh, it's gonna be like fucking nine o'clock. All this stuff's contained in the bag at this point. It's kind of weird time to eat. So we gotta go to our mom and let her grab them. Got it? Oh, pull! Oh. Thanksgiving at Deer Camp. I'm gonna hold up my cream yeah, corn before it does up here. Don't take a picture of the rolls. <laughs> How are your rolls? Man. You can eat the top part. Yeah, you can eat the top part. But there's no butter. This year? Yeah, we had no butter for the yeah, rose? No. no. Oh, man. Oh, we're struggling, dude. Yeah, we got cream corn. It'll be kind of hard to drive in. Yeah, it won't be comfortable. Bye, guys. Bye. See, you, see you next Bye. year. Bye. Bye. You ain't going nowhere. Bye. 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 He just rants and rants and rants. Kind of like Kevin. <laughs> this is this is the very worst part of deer camp right here. Doing the dishes with the no very running worst water. Part. Yeah, do the dishes with no running water. But thanks to Matt, we got draining water. And 
boiling water. It was done earlier. Boys? I got a picture of your wife on my phone. <laughs> In SBT. Yeah. <laughs> my dying wife. Why do you have a picture of my dying wife on your phone? I've got all sorts of pictures on my phone. I mean, it's a pretty happy looking girl for having a major heart problem going on. Yeah. <laughs> Well, guys, it's the it's Deer Day Eve. Deer Day Eve. Yeah. We're hunting in the morning. Look at that hunting. Yeah, but it's it's gun season. Gun season, Clark. We're doing it. Chris is making his Sammys. Did you say a gay nightclub? Did they say? Yeah. yeah. I don't think these bags are big enough. And we ate, and we ate, and we ate some more, and we drank, and we ate, ate, drank, ate. Matt's making lunch over here, world famous Matt Spaniel pulled pork butts. I don't like this as lunch. Oh, dinner. Yeah, it's actually dinner. You're right. Lunch is being made over here. Man, we eat too much at deer camp. I have some food pops. Ow! They were on the table last night, right here. There they are. Cardmaster, camp leader. Gotta deal them out. You just put it. You'll be done sneezing. Well, I'll take it out of here. That one right there, man. No, this one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. What is it? Queen. Oh, you suck. I told you you <clears throat> jinxed yourself last night, man. <clears throat> What's wrong with the queen? I right, find me a nine pointer. <laughs> That's the traveler. Nine Fucking point. spike. Nine point. Damn it. Queen the dough. Uh, Dar Darren called seeing a spike today, and there it is. No, I'm not shooting this. Big 10. What what big big 10 for Matt. <laughs> and Darren. <laughs> no, I'm Chris. <laughs> Or Chris. <laughs> five. That's all I got the five. Maybe I have to draw Broken again. up five. There is a broken up five point up there. Should I draw again since I drew first? Hello, guy. Yeah. You don't go by the picture. What's that count for? Nothing. A rabbit? That's, that's a Chris, mess. Chris drew Mountain Monarch. Fucking Mountain yeah, Monster. Now you look like that walking through the woods. Yeah, hopefully it comes true. Is that trail pretty easy to find? Yeah, I mean, just cross over the creek and keep following it. But well, you're not ready yet? No, I'm ready. I think we're going to be up there like an hour before it gets light out. It's yep. going to be like, like, well, it'll start tinging in 20 minutes. It won't be light for until 7.30. 7 o'clock. <laughs> 7.11 shooting light. I guess or sunrise. Half hour before. This is 6.40, right? Oh. You can see him. Yes, you do. Yeah. We're doing it, man. We're doing something. It is opening day. We're doing something, man. It is not warm out here. What is that temperature? Let's see what this therm thermometer up here. Three in my hand and three in my pocket. Damn, if you're coming up. 20. It's 20 degrees right now. Alright guys, opening day, West Virginia's rifle season, Monday. Uh, we got seven guys out, the neighbors got a bunch of guys out. I've heard two shots already, which is actually a low, a low amount, to be honest. But I think things might get a little western today. So many people in the woods going back and forth. It could get real exciting fast, so we're ready. Cameras are rolling. Really looking forward to uh, killing the mountain monster today. And maybe a bear.
All right, mid-morning update. Um, right at first light, I guess, Matt shot and missed, shot at and missed a monster, he said. He said it was super tall buck. Uh, super tall, not very wide. Nothing that we thinks we have on trail camp, but just a monster. He said three bucks were chasing about 30 does around. It was just pure chaos. But he missed and then saw him a little bit later while he's looking for blood. Uh, Chris, I guess, has had just a six point go by. And I've seen nothing, but I've heard about 10 shots total, including Matt's. And I hear four wheelers all over the place. There's just people on four wheelers every direction. There's a four wheeler about every 10 minutes driving slow. So I don't know if these hill people are down here pushing them with quads or just knocking out till late or moving around or what. But there's a lot of four wheelers being drove around. So anything could happen at any moment. Beep. Beep. Just heard another real close shot. Had to be one of our guys, either Isaac, Steve, or Big Chris. Um, I guess that six point that little Chris saw went over the hill towards Big Chris, so it might have been. I think it's time to get down. It's been about an hour since I shot. I'm just surrounded by deer, but I can't get them to leave. Does, button bucks, spikes. That's about it. No other bucks. So that buck I shot was the biggest that I've seen today. <laughs> Pretty much just the whole herd of deer come up over the ridge. I picked the biggest one, but I'm pretty sure I shot it, I hit it. I'm pretty sure I heard it crash, but it's so hard to tell in these trees. 
So I'm gonna get down and look for blood. See what I can find, but a lot of deer. I guess Matt missed a giant across the way. Well, having a little trouble finding the blood trail, but I found some blood probably about 50 yards from where I shot him. It's bright red. I think it's got bubbles in it, but that's kind of weird. So I'm gonna follow this and see what I can find. I was getting nervous for a second, thought maybe I didn't hit him. But I thought I heard him roll down this hill, so I'll tell you in a second. All right, well, two seconds after I took that last video, I found him. Went about 50 yards. Blood trail was not good. I'm not sure why. Let's see where the shot is in a second. There he is. Mountain eight pointer. A little broken. Fresh. Oh, he must have broke that. He must have broke that rolling down this hill. That thing's fresh. But let's see where this shot is and uh, get him drugged to an area where I can get him gutted. Big body on him. Probably a two and a half year old, maybe three and a half year old. This West Virginia deer, a little smaller than back home. But I'll get him positioned and uh, get a better look to see where the shot was. Here he is, West Virginia 8 point. Uh, body size, I wouldn't say he's a mature deer, but he's definitely uh, bigger than a year and a half year old. He was uh, the biggest buck that came in this herd. Saw all sorts of bucks this morning, mostly spikes, button bucks. But this guy was the first one with a nice, nice little rack on him. Uh, most people don't know, but Caleb, Gore, me, Matt, they all said we were going to get a buck to take home to, to Grandpa this weekend. Uh, only people that are close to the Gores will know what's going on with him, but he can't be here with us this week, and uh, we wanted to take a buck home to him, so this will work. The biggest buck I've shot here in West Virginia, and actually the uh, third buck that I've shot this year. Shot one in Utah, one in Indiana, now one in West Virginia. Almost shot one in Pennsylvania. But now I'll be going for Ohio. All right, well, he's all gutted. Now I gotta get him down this mountain, which is gonna be fun. I know it doesn't look steep on the video, but that's very steep. So pretty much gonna ride him down like a sled with all my stuff. Should be exciting. Uh, we'll see you back in camp because this isn't going to be pretty. You don't want to see it. <laughs> and you got to drag him back, I don't know, five, six hundred yards to get to the road. You got to improvise. This is what I'm doing. Got a hook to my harness. Seems to work okay. Better than trying to drag him by the antlers. But. Got a little ways to go. Next time he's getting quartered. Even if I am on private land not too far from the road, quartering's easier. Put him right on my back. All right. See you at camp.
All right, update number two for the morning. Uh, I just had a doe, or I just had a spike come in, pushing six does, and they were like a herd coming through the woods. I thought it was gonna be a bear, because bear are real loud when they come through these woods here. So I got all ready and excited, and then it was just a whole bunch of does, and then that little spike grunt, and they went off towards Chris, but we got one buck on the buck pole. Isaac recovered his basket, and uh, the rest of us are all still out. Weather's starting to warm up, which is really nice because it was 18, 19 degrees when we got in the stand this morning, but it's supposed to get up into the 40s this afternoon, so it'll feel really good out here, and I'll probably end up just doing an all-day sit. I'm not going back down the mountain and then back up again, so I'll be up here for the duration. Watching them. McDonald's got horns now. <laughs> Another one must have came out of these thickets. Yeah. Joined them. It was a four point. I had. I could have shot him umpteen times. Just they all bedded down there for like 45 minutes. Yeah. He got up and went back up in here. Maybe tomorrow I'll see them. These does are crazy. Six or seven of them just run around all over the place. The one's hot. And the rest are just kind of hanging out with her. <sighs> Only that spike buck though so far. No, no other bucks have come through. But. I like where I'm at because I had these does all around me. And with the one being close to hot or hot, that's what we need. All right, time for the update for opening day rifle. Uh, it's the afternoon now, almost three o'clock. And the last year I seen this morning was probably 10, maybe 10.30. But I just had my first doe of the afternoon go by. A solo doe all by herself, which was kind of interesting. I'm not sure exactly how many deer I saw this morning. A lot of them were repeats. I had the same group of six or seven does going back and forth all morning. So, well, probably around 20. But uh, apparently the buck Matt missed was the mountain monster. Just the giant buck that we've been talking about all week. Um, three years he's been on trail camera. Uh, Matt's pretty down about it. It was a 170 yard shot, I guess he said. And he was chasing does all over the place, so his shot wasn't the greatest on a non-moving deer. But Still got two more days here, plus tonight. And uh, we know they're rutting, and we know there's a ton of deer around, so all it takes is being in the woods.
looked to be uh, looked to be one of the eight points that we had on camera. Definitely not the biggest one we've had on camera, but good buck. Rutting activity, chasing does. Get to take him home and show Grandpa. I told myself I'm shooting a buck to show Grandpa before we go. Feels good. Feels real good. It was a big deal this year to uh, try to bring home some bucks for Grandpa. It's kind of been the motto and the way that we've been hunting this year down here. And I'm happy with them. Really happy with them, actually. Can't ask for much better here in West Virginia. It's been a great week. It's been a lot of fun. Well, here he is. Nice West Virginia eight point. Uh, nice basket rack. Came in chasing does. I had does running around me all day long. I've probably seen 30 plus does. And I'm pretty sure the group that came through when I shot this guy was the same group that came by three times earlier in the morning and then went down that direction uh, towards about 10.30. And I pulled an all-day sit today. I wasn't coming out of the woods. I was going to hunt until I got a chance at a buck or a bear. I did have a chance at a spike earlier that I passed, but this guy will do just fine. Uh, he'll be a great addition to the butcher shop. Great story to tell. We can take him home and show Grandpa. I know me and Isaac now are tagged out gun season. I still have my bear tag, so I'll be bopping around these hills the next couple days from the ground, just trying to catch a bear that gets bumped. But the buck hunting is done. Uh, the only thing that sucks is Chris isn't here. He had to go home. He's got a fire test interview in the morning, but he'll be back tomorrow night. And uh, we'll have two bucks hanging from the buck pole. Well, darkness is coming, but just got word that Caleb shot buck. He didn't say how big, he just said buck down. So I'm gonna grab the shitty. Head over there and help him get it out. Uh, hopefully, I didn't even hear him shoot, so maybe someone else shot too, but he has service up top and I have my in reach. That was the only reason I was able to hear him. So maybe there'll be some other bucks down, but I'm gonna head down that way and wait till he gets out and uh, help him drag it out. Now for the not so fun part. The one mile back to camp drag down a mountain. We're going way down there and then way over there. Worth it. Oh man. Matt's right, world famous. Pulled pork and mac and cheese. Word. Good Sorry God. Chris went home. Yeah, I talked about that already. Chris left. He's trying to get a job. Get a new job. Acceptable. Keep it by me. Uh, you what? Does it got me by the window? I ain't shooting yet. Oh, yeah. Anyway, well, well. Let me see if I'm on the same frequency. Good luck, hunters. Not yet. Today I'm going to take my sandwich out of my bag before I sit on it. That's, <laughs> that's a good call. And, uh, I got binoculars in there and I never break them out either. So you don't need them when you got a scope. Yeah. I still took my binoculars and fucking out the other ones. And I need new binoculars. Mine suck. Okay. Keep, keep looking the gun. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Remember, good luck. Matt, shoot small, miss small. Yeah. Good luck. Good luck to you. Do you need more bullets? <laughs> <laughs> Taking one, that's all I need. The mountain monster ain't safe today. 
All right, well, everyone's out hunting today. It's Tuesday. Me and Isaac are tagged out. We're gonna start butchering some of these deer uh, per the new laws. But I'm gonna do a little quick rundown of the cabin and the changes we've made to it in the last year. So the big one is we put in some vinyl flooring, right? It's just that it's hardwood flooring, uh, composite, uh, pieced together type stuff. Took the old carpet out because it was getting really nasty. Um, we also upgraded our couch situation, so we got two couches now, the love seat and the couch with four different recliners, which have obviously come in handy. You've seen that we've been using the recliners to take our little naps. But the new furniture is way more comfortable than the old stuff, which lasted about 30 years and did a good job. Uh, and then Steve came down, and his addition this year was this new coffee table, live edge, handmade, hand carpentered construction and it's a it fits in real good it matches the picnic table which uses our dinner table and it's been uh it's been pretty nice with all the little upgrades we made this year to the camp uh our next upgrade that we're going to do for next year is we're going to get rid of all that crap and make a uh, complete shelving system same width as this countertop heavy duty to store all our stuff and then the next upgrade after that whenever we come into enough money we we're going to take out this old bathroom, which does not have plumbing anyways, and make this a hallway with some storage. And then hopefully in addition, back there, we put a bunkhouse in, put three or four bunk beds and some couches and maybe some alternate heat. We use the propane burner now, but um, we're going to put a pellet burner in probably in the future. Uh, hopefully this isn't too close to the manifold here. Nope, it doesn't get too hot, but we're going to... Put a pellet burner in eventually too so slow upgrades being made to the cabin um we got enough people coming down where a bunkhouse would probably be very helpful especially for those summertime party type trips and stuff but me and Isaac are going to go out and start working on the deer he's getting the fire going now temperature is about mid 40 so it's not too terrible out here and we got the two bucks hanging hopefully we'll get them all butchered and vacuum sealed today Two bucks on the buck pole. I'm currently in the money on you. You definitely are. <laughs> the buck pool is two deer camps total now. It's a double. It's a double buck pool. Because no one shot a buck last year here in the camp, so this year we had a double. Well, this is it. This is the buck pole for the year. Hopefully the guys bring down some more. But Give this an hour or two, and me and Isaac will have this all in the cooler. Kind of gotten pretty good at it over the years, out of necessity. Plus, Ohio doesn't allow you to bring back carcasses, so there's that. I might do a little cleanup on mine. It got a little leafy. Making progress. Too skinned. Black at it, Deer processing yeah, update. Yeah. Making some progress. Take some home yet? I had Isaac yeah. make us lunch. Ain't that good for your old something? No. Nope. I let Isaac cook on these ones the way he wanted. Fresh West Virginia Tendy. Need some butter. Even that butter. We'll, we'll never bring butter next year. I know, this show too. Yeah. We should have had we should have had Ukraine back, you know. Man, look at that. I need a little more rub, more salt. Rub wasn't very salty. I don't think it was that much of a suck. He's not wearing a tux. I thought you were wearing a tux. You got a haircut? Then I got shook down in Walmart. What? By a cop? Oh, by a bomb. <laughs> Ooh. Did uh, look at your haircut? Fancy, Dang, man! I didn't even know. get a haircut. Look at you! This is just how good I look every day. That's not how you looked when you left. That's for dang oh, sure. Oh, oh. oh, man down! Hey, look, man! There's a pile of bucks. You went to McDonald's. You were so taking bets on where you went. Oh, I had to poop. I blew that. Look <laughs> up. Look at them bucks. 
Hey, look at them bucks, guys. <clears throat> nice. Oh, yeah, fuck me, huh? I already saw yours. Yeah, I know. <laughs> the way, you know, you got to carry in a block or two. Go up for Part of the process. Yep. Vacuum sealing, throw it in the cooler. <laughs> guys it is Tuesday afternoon Chris made it back from his interview and we climbed up to Isaac's spot actually his tree stands right there behind us somewhere climbed up to Isaac's spot and we're just hoping for a little miracle action here yesterday I had bucks chasing does all day so all we need is one of these bucks to chase a doe through here and we'll be set uh, Big Chris and Matt have been out all day. They haven't come back to the cabin, so they're pull they're both pulling all day sits. I think Matt has a broken leg. Matt might have broke his leg on the way up. He's kind of fragile like that. So I think Steve and Darren are both going back out tonight too. So got a lot of guys out. Weather's great for hunters. Maybe not great for hunting, but it's nice and comfortable. We're just in hoodies. Kind of reminds me of the buck tree night. So we'll see how this shakes down. We just heard Big Chris shoot back behind us. He's been out all day. He's been out the last two days all day, but definitely heard him just shoot, so. It could be a fun night. We might be we might be up late tonight. We might be partying. One shot. Hopefully that's a good Yeah, one. just one shot. Well, me and uh Mr. Steve here going back to help Chris. He shot himself a buck, I guess. Big Chris. We don't know how big. But we'll see it when we get back there. Called for assistance on the radios. I've seen 11 today. See a big one? No. Spike. More spike. And then a spike chasing six does. And then a couple of fawns and another fawn. And two more fawns come down. And then look over, he's standing 20 yards next to me. Three pointer? Kilvin. About that tall. Kilvin and Chris are up there. About like that. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. I mean, they're not, it's not you. Yeah. We'll help you get them down. How you far up were you? Yeah. Yes, sir, I did. I can't gut deer anymore, man. I forgot how to do it. You make a mess? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't got a West Virginia deer in a long time. They're different down here. I've been they're in a slump. Different. Did, did you hear me shoot? You a catered meal? Oh, it is. Yeah, I said he made it. I've never been able to wrap something up so nice. In my life. Big reveal. Oh, yeah. Fucking skinny, bro. The spaghetti here, too? Yeah, we can probably leave that one closed. I don't think we're going to need it. Grab this stuff. One here. Yeah, Oh, yeah. all over. See, another one? I didn't realize there was a Where do I cut all that at? I didn't realize it. 
We got the video going. It's gonna, if you can get your fingers in there, you separate it. Do we want this? That'd be part of what Listen, I would about. do a better job if my knife was sharp. One big one? Go out there and get the sharper. It's outside Got of a bunch of supervisors over here. They're doing good. Oh, yeah? Go, boys, go. We're working. We just lost. Chris, that's not what you're supposed to get. Because of Chris. We just lost. Because of Chris. You already lost, you bum. All right, I'm done playing left, right, center. Oops. Dollars <laughs> <laughs> for binky days. Whoops. I lost $3 tonight. Oh. Oh. The moose call. Oh. 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 Man, that was a oh. good game there, that was huh, a good guy? Game at the end. Let me count that for you. Nope. <laughs> She's gonna help. There it is. That's a two year buck pool. That's what it looks like, Chris. This is what the two year buck pool looks you're, like. You're collecting it a little bit early. There's still guys out there. <laughs> there technically is, but I don't have much faith in that at the moment. I haven't heard no caboozles yet. I think we need one more trash bag. Yeah. Man, this place is a mess right now. You'd probably cut them horns off and make rattling horns out of them. Out of your one and two? Yeah. Hell yeah. <clears throat> rattling horns. Not a bad lineup of bucks for West Virginia gun camp. Problem is we could have got a bigger one if we would have shot the ones during bow. Yeah, yeah, we let all the big ones go during <laughs> bow season. <laughs> we were going to get them during rifle and it didn't work out. <clears throat> yeah, we has got some major cleanup to do and then we're getting the hell out of here. Back to civilization. Chris is doing the final floor cleanup. Those heavy duty ones, man, they look they look like I only had to go through two. This is my fourth one. Stick, stick two on top of each other. Bye cabin. Bye cabin. Bye. It was a good year, boys. Another day, another deer camp. It was a good year. It was fun. It was fun here. Sure, it's still beautiful up there, though, ain't it? We should still be hunting. Yeah. We gotta go back to Ohio, though, and kill some monsters. Yeah. Yeah. Well, after. At least it's bigger than one I got. <laughs> I think that's it. Did you say bye, Kevin? I did. I already did. Bye, Kevin. Bye, Kevin. Bye, Kevin. Bye, Kevin. Bye, Kevin. Bye, Kevin. Next stop, Sheets, to get sick for the next week. I feel great now. I feel terrible after Sheets. I don't know if I'll make it to Sheets on my fuel ditch. <clears throat> How far is it? Hour? Yeah, half. 60 miles. What does your thing say? I think it's at home. We'll figure it out. If not, it's half step. It's better. Yeah, we'll see you guys at Sheets. 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 Oh, yeah. Sheets. You guys go next door, though. See ya. Yep. Yep. Get a hundred.